Michael, all right? This is bronze medal. How are you feeling? Um, good, of course. Uh, a bit disappointed with the quarter final. I thought I was controlling the match and I got caught by the Mongolians, so that's a bit of a disappointment. I'd like to have had a semi final against La Rose, so that, that one's annoyed me. But, you know, getting to the bronze medal match and then, you know, securing a, a pretty early win in the match was, was decent and uh, quite happy. Boy, I had a good day as well. He beat Chibana early on, so, you know, you don't, you don't got to think about you to beat Chibana. So that made me a bit more nervous fighting him, and especially because it was home crowd, I thought maybe. Uh, if I let him get into the fight too much, he might get away with it. So it's good to get it done early. Yeah, uh, a lot of simulation today. Was it two? Or was was Ari and Nippon with simulation? Yeah, right? yeah. Tell me about simulation. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't know. I just uh, I've always got good simulation. I've always had it in the locker for a while, but sometimes it's it's a bit poor. <laughs> sometimes I just flop on my back and it's not very good. Doesn't look pretty, and it it just gets me in attacking. But uh, today it was coming off quite well. I, I think my movement was better for it, so it, it worked out well for me today, definitely. Sporting a nice little black eye there, Colin. How'd that, how'd that uh, appear? I'm not too sure. It was in the match with the Georgian boy. I mean, he was a bit of a feisty fighter. He gave me a knee up the butt and uh, he uh, definitely tried to, tried to do a few things in the hold down. I think the referee wanted to disqualify him. I think he punched me in the back a couple of times and he was definitely hands in my face. I don't know if I got it caught when I landed or whether it was because he kept whacking me in the face to try and get out of the hold down. But uh, like I, I think I put something on Twitter earlier saying never let go of a hold, so whatever happens, just keep holding, it doesn't matter if it hurts. Uh, right, and what, what's next now then? Next is Europeans, yeah. Uh, so we, we, we've got maybe uh, probably a week kind of a little bit more subdued, but then we have a prep camp over at Walsall, you know, the new centre of excellence there. So we, we head over there and uh, we'll have a, I think, five day, five day prep camp, so that's going to be quite intense, quite tough. And then we head out for uh, Europeans uh, in France, obviously, this year. And then I think we do the Grand Slam straight after as well in Azerbaijan. So it's a, it's a busy kind of little period now. We get a, a, a bigger break and a bigger time to develop after that. But yeah, initially, with the, with the Masters now being cancelled, it means that we get you know a nice long break after Azerbaijan. So it's going to be a hard six weeks and then time to relax and uh, refocus.